Okay, according to both Bounty in the Comics and Clownfish TV, it seems Rooster Teeth is on the verge of getting Thanos snapped out of existence by their parent company, AT&T. But then again, this is the kind of crap you'd expect. In fact, when you flaunt your political views and basically tell the fans, either if you're not with, if you're against us, get lost. And if you ask me, this is a punishment that Rooster Teeth more than justifiably deserves. Why are the nations so angry? Why do they waste their time with their futile plans? Kings of the earth prepare for battle. The rulers plot together against the Lord and against his anointed one. Let us break their chain, as they cry, and free ourselves from the slavery to God. But the one who rules in heaven laughs and the Lord scoffs at them. Then in anger he rebukes them, terrifying them with his fierce fury. For the Lord declares, I have placed my chosen king on the throne in Jerusalem, on my holy mountain. The king proclaims the Lord's decree. The Lord said to me, You are my son. Today I have become your father. Only ask and I will give you the nations as your inheritance. The whole earth is your possession. You will break them with a rod of iron and smash them to pieces like a potter's vessel. Now then, you kings of the earth, act wisely. Be warned, you judges of the earth. Serve the Lord with reverent, reverent fear and rejoice with trembling. Submit to God's royal son or he will be angry. And you will be destroyed in the midst of all your activities. For his anger flares up in an instant. But what joy for all who take refuge in him. Psalm t chapter 2 in its entirety. And the way I see it, with what they've done now, Rooster Teeth will be dashed to pieces like a potter's vessel. And it's coming soon. And you know what the sad thing is? This could have been avoided. All of this shit for them could have been avoided if they had just done a few things. Several things. One. Respected Monty's wishes in his, after his death in 2015 instead of taking their show, taking shows like Ruby and RV Blue, RVB in the different directions he never would have wanted to go. Two. Blew as much money as they did on a shit heap like Genlock. Yeah, I flat out hated Genlock. Uh, and when I found out who they got for the voice roles, not just for diversity's sake, but how much of a hole they put in their own purse, I got pissed. Three. Scrapping good shows like Camp Camp or The Nomad of Nowhere. Though I watched more of the former than I did the latter. Four. They never should have thrown their hat in with political criminal groups like Black Lives Matter and Antifa or proclaimed their social justice wokeness in general. Never should have thrown that into the fight onto themselves. And five, and most importantly, this PR nightmare could have been avoided if they had chosen to look in, to thoroughly look into the claims against and chose to stick with and not fire one Victor Joseph Mignana from his roles. If they had chosen to stand with Vic like Monty would have if he were still alive instead of throwing him to the wolves on a bullshit rumor started by two two hacks, two greedy wanton media uh, by a trio of greedy wanton 
media grubbing whores named Han Leia, Mars Girl, and LJ Montello. who inspired a coup against Vic at Funimation, none of this, all of this could have been averted. But now, Rooster Teeth, you reap what you sow. And on September the 22nd, when Funimation, Mars Girl, Hanley, and Montella are all found guilty of defamation of character and false firings, not only will you be the ones to literally eat crow, but no matter how hard you beg, no matter how hard you plead with the fan base for forgiveness, they're not going to give it to you. Oh, sure, Vic will give it to you because he's that kind of guy, but he's not going to trust you anymore after what you pulled on him. And besides, from what I've heard, Fantasy Soft is willing to pay him good money. He's willing to move on from crooked left-wing corporations like you and Funimation. That's the truth. I stand with... And you know where, where I stand with this. I stand with Vic... Now, then, and forever. And Rooster Teeth... I honestly wouldn't mind if AT&T pulls the plug on you... Either this year or next. Because... You brought... You may think Vic was the one who turned the fan base against you. No. To quote Obi-Wan, you have done that yourself. Smash the like button, leave a comment, and subscribe to the channel. Mets2128 signing out. God bless, goodbye, and good night. Bang!